Okay, so here, we're gonna have to understand right now grace notes. By the way, guys, please subscribe, rate, and comment, and I hope that these videos, these tutorials help you guys out a lot. Um, that's it, nothing more to be said. There's a bunch of links in the video description. Please donate if you can. Okay, so we got to, to understand grace notes today. Well, uh, one, uh, one of my students threw down that question, and I think it's a great question. So I think it deserves a great answer. Really uh, big ups to Tuma Bid for that. What's up, man? Uh, all the way, um, also London Punker, I'll get to your question in a second. So here, let's do this, guys. Grace notes. So have you ever seen in a piece of music where there's a really big uh, note, let's say there's a dotted quarter note, Okay, let's move this. Let's move this up a little bit. Okay, we got a dotted chord note right here, and then you see these little tiny notes, right? That just like bring in. Here's your eighth note, and then let's, uh, you know, let's give it a tie or something, whatever. Okay, so a little eighth note grace to the quarter note. So what's the grace note do? Well, the grace note clearly, clearly says to you that you can't uh, make it a time. Um, um, that, 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 that the note happens so fast that it doesn't really deserve it, its own time. Does that make sense? So check this out. If I were to put a quarter note and maybe had that hammer on three, four, five to another quarter note, just like this, then I could clearly say, let's say E to a G, I can clearly say quarter, quarter 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 okay but now if i were to make this first note a grace note let's make it really tiny okay really tiny grace note and then put a tie there too and let's keep it at, at e okay really tiny grace note and then a, the normal big quarter note so now the old was quarter to quarter the new way of playing it is going to be that it happens so fast this first note, I'm sorry for the glare, but this first note happens so fast that it, it just goes like this. So ready? Okay, that would be a grace note. Okay, so here's E, quarter, quarter. The new way of doing it would be a grace note, grace, grace. Okay, Where, whereas you hear that first note, but it doesn't really get long enough of a time that you actually would write that down, okay? So the way that it goes is, you know, you just have to tell the musician, the performer, that it happens very fast and it gets a grace note. And that's it. And uh, there's grace notes are for every instrument. They work for, for every instrument. Like 164th, if you wanted to say 164th, fine. But just understand this also, this is a big one too, Nimitz is that grace notes don't get a duration time signature. So if I'm in a time signature of 4-4, four, four, okay, let's say if I'm in a time signature of 4-4 four, four, and I have four quarter notes right here, they can all get tiny grace notes, okay? Here's my four quarter notes, four quarter note, one quarter note, quarter note, quarter note, quarter note, and then there's four, let me move, move this up. See these four quarter notes? Quarter note, quarter note, quarter note, quarter note. And then there's four grace notes that are attached to the quarter notes, okay? So all of the graces are, are in eighth note. It still works in the time signature of 4-4. Four, because four. the grace notes, all of their eighth notes, they don't really get the duration of an eighth note. They're just saying it happens so fast that they don't really get any time duration. They're just saying is that when you go to play these quarter notes, um, just make sure that you grace into them with the note before it, okay? And uh, this is wrong. I have this on G. I should really, to make this kind of work out, I should really put E, okay, E, E, and then E, and then that would be this. Let's do this as four chord notes. One, two, ready, go. Uh, one, two, ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And that's it, okay? So if you don't know, then now you know. And just understand that grace notes are a lot different than a, than, than a note just simply going fast. If a note's very fast, you might see that written down as a 64th note or a 128th note. I've seen it before. Check out Joe Satriani's music. He has uh, 64th notes all over because he does very, very, very fast legato stuff. That's his bag. 
Jerry Satriani does tons of, of legato stuff. You'll see tons of um, uh, legato, not, necessar not necessarily grace notes, although they are in there. So yeah, if you didn't know what grace notes were two minutes ago, you do now. Well, four, well, four minutes ago, then you do now. So I hope that, that, this, that this, this video helped you guys. And again, don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment, and uh, also donate if you can. Once again, there's video links in the video description. And uh, hope that helps. You guys rock.